Okay guys, we're here with Deep Green Genetics and we're here with Ua. You want to tell me what's going on here? Just tell me what's going on. You got a lot of awesome stuff. I'm seeing some really nice clones and just awesome stuff. Tell me what's going on. Yes sir, well right now our friend, uh, we are actually Deep Green Genetics. We came over here from Hawaii. Uh, we got a group of other sun-grown geneticists. By coming together as a family, you know, we sit down, we eat dinner together, we're family. You know, we like to share our children, our genetics that are grown very in the open and all the environment. We're dealing with pathogen soup out there. You know, you're dealing with a real world situation. So our seeds, we stand by the fact that these are real seeds. They're not grown in a laboratory with HEPA filtration, selling you some, you know, test tube baby. So we love having plants that are real genetic and we give that to you. Uh, even Humboldt Seeds is a partner of ours and those guys have been in the game forever. Some of the best in the world and they, we all know we gotta grow the real thing and we're gonna represent, we're not gonna sell you some moldy, some plant that'll die from powdery mildew and infect your crop. You know, we want your stuff to be bomb. We have a bunch of different cool strains including award-winning ones like uh, right now Josh is online he's got his some of his strains in here as starts these are plants his family's third generation farming and uh, up there in Oregon so these plants have been around since 90 some of them the mothers that from that it's cut off of moms he doesn't usually sell things like this his, his seeds go for a couple hundred and we get here we show up to these events I get the booth for deep green and by deep green that means we bring all of us together we have on the booth you have a couple hundred strains available today right now and we get freebies make sure it makes sure people are happy and with deep green we actually Actually, we'll go through the whole life cycle and talk you through it, tell you how, if you have any questions you have, what soil you can use. We don't use amendments. We, went, we do five cycles a year in Hawaii. So with our sticky finger seeds, we're actually able to do, you know, we did several cycles of just water so that in our pheno hunt, we're getting real phenos, not addicted to juice, not addicted to this, um, you know, amendment, this nutrient. You can do whatever nutrient you want, but us using water, we know what's in that plant. Uh, we don't even have to use steaks. We're not using netting. We just grow it. We get it about hip high switch to 12 hours and we got nine footers all day long, 45 day cycles on things like our Maui Megillah. So really fast and we're growing again, five cycles every year. So we're banging right through. And uh, other growers we have, um, Aloha Island Genetics is from Kauai. We got um, actually Hawaiian Budline from Big Island, but a Nick. We got Conscious here, Oregon, Zion is Cali. But again, we're all family. So by working in family, we can keep this industry not being, you know, Walmart weed. We don't want we don't want the McDonald's weed of the world. We want to be craft, period. And and come to events like this, we're not all in suits, you know. And nice to see people enjoying. I've seen nothing but joy here. And, uh, yes, I. What's it? Yes, I. Yes, I. When I started off the event, I got to do a Hawaiian blessing downstairs with my conch shell and like open it up, ask permission to do it traditionally Hawaiian. And that's kind of the idea of what we're trying to do here is keep this as a, as a family unit moving forward. Make sure this is more of a family than an industry. And if we can do that way, we're all going to win. I mean, we're going to have the best taste at the end of the day. You know, we're, I grow flour as a byproduct. You know, we got seeds coming to you, so we're not growing for mass. We're not growing just for the numbers, you know. And if we can keep that where you're growing the best out of your life, uh, we give it a lot of elders come for their first time they're legally growing in their life in a lot of these states. Um, I've done like seven states in the last few months, and it's like, Every time you go, you just see the joy in people's life. They're like, I'm not going to go to prison for this shit. Well, it's time to grow, man. And DEA just said so. DEA is like, hey, bring it home. Let's see what you got, you know. And uh, we're going to keep doing this. If we can keep the message out there. I went to a bodega last night and gave away 80 little two-packs so that people are in the backyard. They're getting all excited right now downtown. Homie, my friend Haas will be passing out free seeds. And people are like, what is happening right now? We went to the bodega for a soda and we got a free seeds. Like, that's the kind of stuff we got to do. You know, make it, make people joy, you know, give people some joy. There's like a lot of what's going on in the uh, cannabis community we want to keep the craft growers and the craft industry sort of like uh, at the forefront of our minds right because you, you want to make sure that you're getting that quality so just speak to those growers quickly about like the importance of the craft cannabis industry yes sir well, the whole key really is keeping it uh, working together, and you'll see that that's been happening. Uh, like, I brought chai lattes upstairs for all my humble crew. Up there. That's my family up there. Uh, we went over here. We made new friends and in inroads. A lot of people are doing um, not just craft cannabis growing, but the, the growers are busy, man. My people are busy. They're, they're at their farm, bro. It's hard to drag these guys out the farm. He worked till the minute he had to be here. Josh was working at his farm till the minute he had to get on that plane. Um, I'm able to be here, so we're dragging a couple of them out of their work, hard work, for a weekend so we can represent and they can tell you what the genetic from it's the love of our lives you know and i'm uh with deep green genetic we make sure we do that also we're part of earth dance earth dance sponsors us a lot so with earth dance we're also doing music with it we're adding music to that circle so live music love we we're giving away free cds all weekend um sponsored by earth dance and uh deep green so with that idea is if not just us as growers I'm representing multiple growers, but then we're also working with other guys who are selling other people's seeds. And we can all work together. Again, we're getting the craft out there, but the growers don't have the time to be getting off the farm all day. They're, it's a full-time job. You try to go 10 plants is one thing. This video is brought to you by Mars Hydro. 
where they have a variety of grow lights and grow tents for growers of all experience levels. Whether you're a small home grower or setting up a slightly bigger commercial operation, they have the tents and lights for you. They have tents for every space and need, including the new two-in-one tents. And they also have a wide variety of lights to choose from, including full-spectrum LED and the new detachable FCE series. Links to all of the products that we use on this channel, including the Mars Hydro Grow Lights, are in the description below. Be sure to use the links below to support the ICANTHC channel. You can also save a few bucks on the Mars Hydro website by using the code ICANTHC at checkout for store-wide savings. Don't forget to use the code and save yourself a few bucks. Now, back to the video. Chinoa's favorite line is if you come work with me with weed, you'll hate weed by the time you're done. Work with me because you got 20 foot plants. He's doing 40 foot circumference, 20 footers. It's gnarly, nine month cycles. Uh, we're in Hawaii, five, five cycles a year. We're just banging it out you know, as fast as we And having fun. And, and pheno hunting from the heart, not pheno hunting for, again, not looking for girth. Real craft is you're getting something that's just so good, you can't forget that flavor ever. You take a hit and like, oh, and you pass that seed to someone to grow the best weed of their existence. And that's, we're giving it to a lot of first timers. That's a, that's a big part of our mission. We're, we're actually uh, coming out, we're gonna have these fold outs coming up in the next couple of months. They're fold out little displays, we'll go into all the horticultural shops around here. We got some mom and pop brick and mortars that are taking it up too. So that's a big part of the battle is these guys are selling you grow supplies. Here, have some Hawaiian genetic with your grow supplies. People are excited about that. And you know, needless to say, I, Chicago, I came here, Nikan in December. Same thing, a lot of younger kids, a lot of elders just coming true and they were like, man, we want to grow some weed. I'm like, we'll tell you how to do it. And there was a lot of other, the, the quality, you know, even if they're gotten bigger, like I said, like Humboldt is a, a huge company taking care of the Yurok Indian tribes, doing all these wonderful projects around the world. And yet, together we're still family. You know, we sit down and have a good meal together. And if we can keep it where it's more than just, uh, we can sit at the dinner table, not just the business table. I really think that's the most important thing is bringing it home. If, if, when's the last time you smoke weed with somebody and didn't care for them? Everyone nice to each other, like, let's share, you know? <laughs> Look, it's a big difference from being like, yeah, that's mine. You keep going like, I'm mine. No, no way, man. But, but, and I know Rastas don't pass the joint too much, but we give them, everybody got a doobie in that situation. <laughs> <laughs> just make sure to support our craft cannabis growers and just support what they're doing because that movement is so important to the industry guys so we're going to check out what's going on with some of the other other booths and stuff but huge thank you Ua, yes, for sir. having uh, for having the time with me and just showing us what's going on with deep green it's really really awesome and they're doing some great stuff so check them out across all the socials and we put links down below yeah we'll have to get you my canoe back on maui man for sure man yeah. gotta get the canoe guys <laughs>